Oh, man. Getting right into it. Game one, let's go. Game Bowser one. versus Fox, Lunik versus Mordi. I'm excited. Oh, same here, most definitely. Going to Starterville, obviously, best place to start. You never know. You, you always see it on almost every game. I don't know what – I'm guessing Bowser likes low ceilings, but I mean – Oh, yeah. He's a big angry dragon. I'm pretty sure he can operate anywhere. Now, Lunik, he's going to have to pretty much – he's going to have to play in shield a lot, but I don't think he has – Bowser as a character has fast enough out of shield options to punish Fox's uh, options, such as up to – we're seeing a lot of that coming out from more D. He can't uh, punch with up B? Maybe. Well, maybe not. Maybe he looks he's like getting, he just tried, Yeah, he's getting stuffed. Dude. A lot of his options are getting stuffed. Gee, he's grabbed got stuff by up tilt right there. Yeah, Mori's going to have to watch out for those uh, options when he's under his opponent. Bowser can be very scary because of his large reptilian oh, behind. Oh, no. This Is might this it? do it. The rage working in his favor. The forbidden combo. The forbidden combo. <laughs> he's able to take that stock. Now Mordi has to get this kill somehow. Bowser being a fat body is going to be very hard to get to just to get this stock off of him. Excuse also, me. if Luna can pop up even a little bit in with a big meaty down B, and that's scary. Like that, Just the prospect of that makes you not want to be on your opponent, but still going to seal it off for that uh, up air off of the uh, jump read on the ledge. And Mordi able to actually close out that side. That, that was essential. He does not want Bowser sitting on that rage. He could get him to 60% again, and we'll just see a repeat of stock one. Great jab out of that down air, but up he's going to cover pretty much every option the neutral has to offer. Oh, my Lazy God. No. Oh, my Are goodness. Are you kidding me? The back air. Oh, my goodness. The lazy boy. Like That's not said. the world I want to live in, man. That's too lazy. Oh, my goodness. That's too lazy. Jeez. Free. The back air. That no. back air. He was waiting for it. He knew he didn't have the rage to up air. So he was like, I'm going to read how you're going to DI. <laughs> you're a fast follower. You're going to be right here. Yeah. I'm not the TO. Oh, ask Jeff. I didn't. I didn't write the rules, guys. I just interpret I, I them just, and yell them at people. I just commentate. I just yeah. I, I just. I, don't, I just, I just say here. lazy boy and yell. <laughs> Man, but Morty, he's he he can't let that shake him. Got to go into game two with a better game plan. Definitely part of that game plan is to not get grabbed. So he's, breaking. Looking, he's looking to stay Fox. I mean, he wasn't doing too bad. It was just Luna got those grabs that he needed. That was nuts. He was not ready to DI that. That was like all. worst case scenario, man. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I thought he was going to get a little bit more. Fox being such a fast faller, just almost everything working on him. Luna looking good. Up, be out of shield. Oh, oh my God. Yeah. Up tilts. Caught his jump. Oh, got it back. Man, this Jab is coming through for him. He's not going to work. Just boxing him. Yeah. Oh, oh, and he texts it. Will he be able to make it back? Yes, he will. That was a very, very risky thing to do. Ooh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. This could be bad. Up smash. That's not going to be able to do it. Sends him off stage, though. The scariest thing about Bowser, in my opinion, is that down tilt on the ledge. Like, you just don't know. Like, am I going to get knocked into space even though I grab the ledge? I have no idea. You really don't. You have to be very careful being in that situation. And right now, this is where Morty wants him. He, got, he has to take control. He has him in the air. Now he's doing his best to make it so that he cannot land. Morty might be a little bit impatient here. He seems to be, like, pulling the trigger on those kill moves before it's time. You see, he's trying to get these grabs. He's trying to get these grabs at shield. But he just keeps, oh, excuse me, he keeps getting stuff. Oh, the dare just does it. DT, DT. And it works for him. He's got to chase those jumps, man. It's, like, Bowser's not going to air dodge if he doesn't have to. It's just too risky. All right, there you go. Up till in the up air, doing the job. It is an even game right now. Free stock combo. Sorry, I don't like that combo. You don't? <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. The B&B &B that leads into the PB&J. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Now we're seeing we're seeing Morty doing his best to keep the pressure going on Lunik. You don't want to you don't want to let Bowser land. You don't want to give him a chance to grab you. And you see Lunik waiting in shield a lot, but not long enough because Morty is just keeping these up tilts coming. But surprisingly, even despite all those hits landed, I do not feel confident saying anyone is in an advantage at this point. Right, right here, definitely not, because one grab will spell the end. Uh oh, this might be bad. Morty stock. Yeah, he still has his that. jump. Now he'll be able to get back. And again, he, Morty is doing his best just to keep it so that Lunik's not getting his turn to play. He's like, this is, it's my turn, not yours at all. Oh no, mm. Lunik's landing. He almost got the, if he had gotten the grab right there. Literally, all he did was jump on the stage, and it worked. Oh, will he be able to make back? Wow. 
Nice. Like, can he? Uh, great. He, great. He, good he patience. Good he, patience. He didn't even do anything right there. He was expecting him to drop down and just leave him be, but no. It's going to be 1-1. One, one. A little bit of a turnaround. I, I don't know whether you call it a turnaround or not. It was just a spooky first game. Like, big, fat, lazy boy. I, sorry, I can't stop saying it. It's just fun. <laughs> like, I, how often do I get to commentate a Bowser? I'm going to say lazy boy a lot. That sorry is to fine. Dance. It's a great word. <laughs> that is totally fine. Yeah, I, I didn't. I, like I said, I'm taking that. I'm using my <laughs> own commentary. But, jeez, that's a, it's now 1-1. I imagine he doesn't want to go to Battlefield. I bet we're going to see TNC. I can see TNC or, or FD. It depends on what they ban. Uh, uh, and you oh. are right. That's one one commentator point for me. <laughs> Hope you're keeping track at home. He's winning right now. But going to game three, it's one apiece. Now, it'll be it's literally whoever gets the momentum going, and uh, it's it's just all theirs. And <laughs> That looks like momentum to me. That's all the momentum, just with these up airs. And you see Loon getting desperate, landing with these dares. He's not, it works. He, he needs to hold off on these out of shield options. He's just letting them hit his shield once. He's not letting them do it again or even run away. See, there you go. Uh, B, you let, he let him do it twice because he knew he was going to press a button again. He doesn't need to worry about Fox trying to grab him because I think that's why he's... Oh, my goodness. Oh, that was cute. And remember this, guys. For every safe option your opponent uses, there's a million unsafe, unsafe options he's going to follow it with. So it's not smart to just immediately punish the first thing your opponent does. Sometimes you got to wait. Lunik made good use of that. That's where he got his uh, up be off. But right now, it does not care because Morty does not show any signs of slowing down. And Lunik looking like a deer in the headlights. Smart. Smart that he went straight down when he realized he wasn't going to get the read. Lunik's just jumping out of stuff. All right, you see why he tries to grab out there. He needs to start holding shield a little bit longer. Morty hasn't even grabbed him. He's just been throwing moves on his shield and punishing Lunik because he knows. He knows he wants to get that grab. He's getting too overzealous and just throwing out his out of shield options and they keep getting stuff. Morty just realized, you know what? Either this guy doesn't know the matchup or whew, I don't want to see it. I can see it being a little troublesome for Bowser. I can definitely see that. Oh Fox can goodness. be very confusing if you're not used to fighting against him. Oh, like, I believe it. Because those frame traps and on top, like, you're like, man, he can combo anything into anything. What is going on? You really got to practice that matchup to know that he can't just up tilt to up air you all the time. But he can do it most of the time, and that's bull honky. But that's another conversation. We're getting, <laughs> into, <laughs> we're getting into game uh, four. Okay, so game he's going four. back to Battlefield. I get why, but this still is an advantageous stage for Fox. I mean, he wants this so that he's living much longer than normal compared to other stages. But he's not been able to get his game started. But right now, he's getting the game started like he wants to. Nice grab. Another I love the grab. grab there. Good damage. And the jab's coming out from Lunik. He's yeah. doing his best. He has stage control. He's doing his best to keep the pressure going. I'm surprised. How are they still back? How are they back? Oh, okay. Lunik counterpicked the battlefield. I was like, why? I thought Morty won here. Well, he did, but Jim, you can agree to it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take Fox here. I mean, I get <laughs> why, but it just – look at this right here. Nope. That's not that's not what I want for him. I want him to not be at Battlefield with Fox. I want FD or something because this is rough. Or did he win on FD? He, uh, they didn't go to FD. They yeah. started on uh, – I, I guess I just don't understand this counter pick. Like, this place is awful against Fox. Wow, he was able to back air and then land and still up tilt. That's just – that's rough. It's crazy. He, it's just that Lunik hasn't been able. He get it. He gets his game established. And then it's once it's once his turn is over, more D is like it's my turn. Good patience, but it's gonna take more than upbeats to win this. Nice, stuffing the jump. Lunik on the offensive now got some advantage. He's just throwing the kitchen sink at him on that leg. Man, he's he's doing his best. When it's his turn, he's doing his best. Ooh, Ooh punishes that miss. F tilt is way too committal of an option for that situation. Your kill percent, you're stuck on the ledge, and F tilt's gonna have so much lag on it. And yeah, your opponent can just jump over it in back air. Exactly. And man, this is looking all this is looking all Morty. He's getting the pressure going. He's not letting Lunik have a chance. Uh oh. oh I thought we were gonna see something crazy. Alright, I'll be out of shield. Alright, good call. Good call. He's able to do it. Now about Bowser again, being the Ooh, character that there he is, is. Yep, there getting it is. that stock, just as I was about to say it, being the character that he is, he can make this comeback. I'm gonna call this. I'm gonna call this even right now. It pretty much is, especially <laughs> when you you're in a situation like this. And a great presence of mind from Morty. He is not air dodging after he's up tilt. He's like, I'm getting out of this situation. But right now, he's got to be careful and Ooh, does what? not react. <laughs> that he, was nuts. He like stopped in front of him, grabbed him like Dragon Ball Z. He he did not react to him side being on stage. He thought he was gonna get hit. Realized he didn't get hit and 
that was it. But, uh, oh, my <laughs> goodness, these dares coming out from Lunik. He's Nobody just, expected that. <laughs> just Hail marrying with him right now. He does not need to be doing that. Oh, he wants to grab. He knows if he gets the grab now, it will do it. Luke, I see Lunik wants to grab, but I feel like for the time being, he's been waiting too long to do it, and now he's just kind of, like, making up for lost time. Now he's just all grabs. Oh, my goodness, the up tilt actually breaking the grab right there. It's tournament stock for Lunik. He's going to have to do something. He's going to be knocked into losers. Definitely not what he wants. Was... He wants to force this game five situation. Sorry, winner side stock for Lunik. Oh, the up Beautiful. smash reading the empty hop into him. Oh, my goodness. Just YOLO again, DT, DT. He just does it, and it works out. You only got to see one hole in your opponent's neutral. Like, spacing is great, but you can work through that, especially if you're a giant angry dragon with spikes on your back. Jeez, that worked. Oh, my goodness. Hello, hello. Did that work? We are forced. He has forced a game five situation right now. I mean, Morty's counter pick. I couldn't think of a better stage for him than Battlefield, but there we were. Exactly. Uh, knew like what he was doing. <laughs> I take it back, buddy. You're going to watch this again, and I'm sorry. That's a good counter I can, I can imagine he's going to take him back. <laughs> Who knows? It's crazy. This is a, we've had two, numerous hype sets right now. This is, this is pure pandemonium. A lot of game fives. I love it. A lot of love commentating these game fives. I'm just eating them up right now with my good buddy Reed. Take me to Battlefield. Take, is he going to take him to Battlefield? I can see Battlefield. Take Bat me on a long walk through Battlefield. Again, the benefits is he's living longer, but it, the downside is that it's Fox's best stage. <laughs> he utilizes those platforms much better. I would almost say that it's Dreamland in this situation. Yeah. But no, we're, we're going, going back. We're going back. Multi-man smash, optimal choice. <laughs> Anywho, it is game five right now. It's, again, 2-2 two, two on both sides. Who's going to advance the winner's final where Zane awaits? Will it be Lunik from Ohio or will it be Morty representing Indiana? And you know Morty's a little bit little bit concerned about his spacing, op spacing options now. He doesn't want to throw out random jumps and back airs because he might catch an up smash, and that's scary. Like That cost him a stock, and that was his game to win. Exactly. You know he did not want the game five situation. He wanted to clean 3-1 move on to winners. Uh, I gotta say, finals. I'm shocked how many down airs the Lunik has landed. Like, he's making that move look real smart. I mean, if it's if it's it's working for him for the most part, but now we're seeing Morty not falling for it anymore. He's like, you fool me once, shame on you. Fool me, what, seven, Bro, eight more times? Bro, it was a lot times? more than once. That's all yeah, I It's definitely a lot more than <laughs> once. It's, 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 it's more than you'd expect. <laughs> oh, he Ooh, whips the F smash. Pay for it. And there we go, the Koopa doing the dirty deed. No reason to commit to that option. You got back air, buddy. You <laughs> or you have okay, up smash. Sorry, you there interrupted you my go. sentence. <laughs> there you go. It is dead even right now. Who's going to advance to winner's finals against Zane? It's really going to come down to the wire. It really has. The, oh, almost Lunic all the previous games. Him. Most All the past two games have been, well, with the exception of uh, JJ versus. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he tries to go for the fair. We just had a ton of hype sets, a couple game five situations, and... Man, oh man, this is a very tough moment. He shield uh -oh. grabs him. He's going to go for a back air. He air dodges out of the situation. Another, another good 10%, and he's going to be. Oh my goodness, he is in Koopa percent. He needs to more. He's staying cards, right? aware of that down tilt, just pausing a little bit before he side beats back on stage. With down air is going to cost him. We Let's see how much. Good jabs into ooh, the ooh, perfect yeah. pivot. We like that. He needs to be careful. This is not looking good. These down airs are going to haunt him. You know what? That was a smart air dodge. That's the first up air dodge I've seen him take, and Morty did not go for any of the uh, chicanery involved with it just because he just not, didn't expect it. You see, he throws him into the air. He knows Lunik is panicking when he's in the air. Oh, oh no. no. Fourth throw. Probably not what he meant. I am surprised that didn't cost him the... Oh, and he hops over him. Crowd is going crazy right now. This is it. The forward tilt. That's not going to be able to do it. Sends him off stage again. Another edge guard attempt. Does not catch him with the down tilt. The fair, oh. and that will do it. An amazing match from both players, but Lunix able to clutch it out, moving on to winner's finals. This is Ohio versus Ohio Damn. winner's finals, and Indiana is going to have to battle each other and Chicago. He jumped up and swatted that boy out of the sky. Oh, my goodness. 